back to the channel and today we got another collab banger just for you. And once again, I'm here too guys, it's Big Belly Bob. Yes, so like she said, we are doing our second day of our two-day collaboration with T and V Nation. Once again, that's Tawana and Vaughn, whose premiere of their video will start pretty much right after this one. I'll probably leave about a couple of minutes time for everybody to get over there, but I'm gonna time it. So right after this premiere, you're gonna shoot right over to TNV Nation. I'm gonna drop their link right here, down below, and inside the chat if you're in the live chat, okay guys? So, before we get started, what do we have to do first? Pray. Before that, I like to say, well, you can pray first too. I mean, yeah, I thought. Let's pray first. And, yeah, yeah. I don't know your little spiel yet. What do you though? mean? You I don't watch my videos. Point. I just do the point. <laughs> All right. Yeah, you know, and, I, and we just wing it. It's not like we rehearse it. So <laughs> when we come at you, we coming at you true and genuine because she don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on. We just kind of wing it. That's just the type of person I am when it comes to these videos. All right. So what I meant to say was, Thumbs up this video, guys. Yeah. All right? Make sure you comment below. Yeah. Share this sucker out to everybody. Mm -hmm. I would not be mad at you for sharing out my videos and showing me some love, all right? Mm -hmm. The world, if you can. At the same time, if you're new to this channel and haven't subscribed to me, please hit the subscription button and the notification bell so you can see when either I or we put out a video for you, all right? Okay. So. Let's go ahead and get this prayer on. I think Miss Shan's going to lead the prayer today because I did it yesterday. All right. Dear Father God, we thank you for this food that we have before us. May it be nourishing to our body. May it keep us healthy and strong. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen, guys. All right, all right. Excuse the height difference in our chairs. I was just looking at it. I was like, hey, it looks a little different, but I just like to sit low, guys. Uh, so, with that being said. We've got some vegan food today, which was the collab. And we've got here a different array of vegan food that you can find at your supermarket. We made sure they were 100% vegan. So, we've got the mac and cheese. I believe it's chow. Cheese. I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but it's the vegan cheese, the chow cheese. They actually have it in slices too, but that's the mac and cheese. And then we have a Buddha bowl, and the Buddha bowl is veggies, uh, kale, chili covered chickpeas. Um, it also said some uh, creamy tahini sauce over some cauliflower rice. So it's pretty much all just vegetables, 100% vegan. Sounds good though. And then we have... These are the chicken sliders. Uh -huh. So they're all vegan, 100% too. Came with the buns also, so the buns should be good. And then these were the beef tips. Yep, beef tips. Yeah. And those actually look like some real beef tips for real. I pan seared them like they instructed and it kind of got nice little, you know, sear on, on them. Yeah, so those are 100% vegan too. So everything that we're eating uh, was 100% vegan and not vegetarian. So they're all right. vegan friendly. And in the middle, we have um, vegan sausage. Uh, oh, no, the pizza, pizza bites. The, yeah. pizza, the pizza bites. So those are pizza bites, 100% vegan as well. Uh, so we decided to go with this because uh, there was so much stuff to choose from in so many places and you know I kind of want to try a few things that I can get on a regular basis uh, without having to go. Actually she came up with the idea once again, the brains and the belly. I'm going to go ahead and try this beef. Alright, so she went right in for it. How does it taste? I didn't do any seasoning or any sauce on it. I just kind of kept it how it is. I really just wanted to taste it. Mmm, that's good. Mmm, mmm. Yeah, it doesn't have the meat texture, obviously. You, you can taste once you break it up, but it's not bad. So if I was to put some sauce and a little seasoning on these things, I can see myself snacking on them again. It kind of got the texture of a meatball, more or less. Mmm. It's hot. Yeah, so there was no sugar, 
of pepper veggies, sweet potato, kale, chili pepper, chickpeas, cauliflower rice. Greens in here too. And uh, it's kale. Ah. And the uh, creamy tahini sauce. That's good, huh? That's yeah. Very flavorful. Yeah, like I said, when I, you know, prepared, blah, prepared everything like it was supposed to be, I didn't add anything extra to it. I will say next time maybe. I might spike it up just a little bit, but nice you said it's good like it is, guys. Mm. Mm. I'm gonna try one of the bites. They smell good. They actually smell like pizza bites. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's what the inside looks like. It tastes like a, it tastes like a pizza roll to me. Mm. Like a, what is it, Tony's or one of the other ones. But yeah, it looks like a nugget, but it definitely, definitely tastes like a pizza bite. Like a pizza, a pizza roll. roll. Yeah. Mm hmm Hmm. Get these in the oven. You can microwave them if you like. I did them in the oven, so I get a little bit more of that crisp in. Yeah, they're, they're good. I'm kind of glad I didn't cook them all so I can snack on them again later on. Mm -hmm. I said I like these the best so far. Hmm. Well, I might as well go into this. But make sure you guys go over to TNV Nation. Make sure you watch their videos, subscribe to their channel. But like I said, I'm going to drop the link a few times throughout this video. That way you can go over there. And if you're in the live premiere watching this, guys, um, hush up, baby. You know, Diva likes to be seen on camera. So, after this premiere, we're going to go right on over there together. And we're going to watch their video. As it looks like they might have made some burgers and stuff. And we were going to actually gonna get some burgers. Um, but we saw all this other stuff. So, I'm going to go straight for one of these chickens. Which, it looks just like a chicken patty. Smells like it, it feels like it. Question is, does it taste like it? I'm gonna say it tastes like a mild chicken patty or something I got out of the vending machine at work. Cause you never know what you got out of the vending machine at work. That thing could be chicken, might, I don't know. You know how that uh, suspicious meat and sus suspicious product that comes out of the vending machine at work. Hmm. How you like it? It was a little dry. I needed some type of sauce or something. Maybe if I had a piece of that cheese. I That's what I told you I was gonna do. Let me take some cheese and try that. Mm. Tastes good? Mm-hmm. My thing is I wonder if the vegan cheese is better on my stomach. But you know, I don't handle cheese as well as I used to when I was younger. Mm -hmm. So, it still has a cheesy taste to it. You know, not, you know, the... So I wonder if any guys, anybody in the, in the video or the chat watching it, let me know the full facts on this. Is this really healthier for me? Or is it still kind of going to do me like regular cheese would? Really digging the two combination here of this mac and cheese and this chicken sandwich. So once again, how many people have never tried any kind of vegan food at all? I this mean, is part of my first time. It's definitely my first time. I've already stated that. I thought you would have had something, but before me, you seem to have tried everything without me. Mm -hmm. You know, I was just never thought I would enjoy it, which actually I do. I definitely would eat these again. Um, I definitely would eat these little chicken sliders again. And price wasn't bad. I mean, you got four sliders for less than $4. Uh, all of it was pretty much around $4 in the freezer section. So you need a, a nice snack. This is where you go for your lunch, I would say. Yeah, like your 
favorite snack foods. Oh, it's beef dish, you could probably mix it, you know, with some pasta or and mm. make a nice little dish out of that with the beef tips. Yeah, I said kind of reminds me of like meatballs anyway. Because mm -hmm. meatballs are 100% meat, I'm sure. So yeah, like I said guys, make sure you follow me on over to TNV Nation's channel. We're not going to hold you up long tonight. We really just wanted to share this experience with you, share some of this food with you. Hopefully, we even introduce you to something new that you might go out and give a shot. Um, but like I said, once again, we had the mac and cheese, we had the Buddha bowl, we had the beef tips, love the uh, pizza little bites. I absolutely like the chicken sandwiches. As you notice, I ate two already. I'm definitely about to smash this one here. There's something spicy in there too. You taste something spicy There's in there? Chili, chickpeas. Did you eat that with that in one bite? Mm -hmm. The meat and that, so it tastes good, the combination? Mm -hmm. Cool. Try yeah, I guess I can try one before we go, guys. Let me let me get a scoop. She don't like me digging her food over there, so let me make it quick. Mm -hmm. I don't know what I'm saying. It kind of reminds me of a like a lean cuisine or something, how you get this kind of mix, some meat and lean cuisine. That's kind of what it makes me get the idea. Well, anyway, guys, uh, like I said, we're not gonna stick around too long, so what we need you to do is thumbs up this video, comment below, guys, share this video out, share it out. And if you're new, once again, subscribe to the channel mm -hmm. so you can see me and Miss Shan again. Uh, or you might just see me doing a challenge. I've been trying to get her to do something with me, even some of the tasty ones. So maybe we'll get her. Maybe if you guys comment below saying, you know, cheer her on, do a challenge, you know, maybe we'll get her to do one. All right? But with that being said, guys, I'm Big Belly Bob. And Miss Ann. And I always say peace. Peace. And yeah, bye. Bye, guys. <laughs> That's what she usually says. She usually says bye. Like I said, we don't rehearse this, and I'm not going to cut that out. We're just going to keep it like that, guys. Once again, head over to TV Nation. I'll see you there. We're out. Bye, guys.